What's up everybody? Welcome back to Bed Wars. We're playing solo today. It's great to have you here because otherwise I'm gonna be all alone. Me playing solo is kind of a rare occasion, I feel like. I'm always playing doubles uh, when, I, when I'm playing Bed Wars, just because I feel like doubles is so much more entertaining, M maybe for you as a viewer, but mostly for me, I feel like, just because you have more action going on with more players in the game. You also got, uh, you got your teammate as well that is generally being a silly little goose. Um, I do need to be aware of this guy jumping down at me. Okay. Uh, okay, I landed and he did not, which is perfect for me. Let's go ahead and uh, clean this bed here. Clean it up right off the map. Okay, I was just waiting to heal up a little bit, see what he was planning on doing. And we'll have a nice fight here. Yes, he has high ping and I took that to my advantage. I think this gray player uh, is going to want to kill me. Let's find out. Actually, he might leave me alone, which is very surprising since I'm pretty sure he saw me collect... All of the emeralds. Oh, but yellow's coming in. Um, let me quick drop this off. And I think my only chance of winning, yeah. Oh, wait, never mind. He stopped attacking. I'll take it, I'll take it. I was going to say my only chance of winning that fight was hitting him off the edge. Um, and then once he got into my base, I thought it, I thought it was over for me. But nope, uh, looks like he somehow ended up throwing. He also, I think, brought me four diamonds, so thank you for... For that and I have eight M's I'm just gonna buy up some obby we'll see if anyone comes to contest me while I'm placing it okay so it looks like the only teams left in the game are gray and pink and neither of them have beds so it's really just cleaning up some kills here should I just sit at my base I almost feel like that's the play here just sit at my base and as they come in kill them I don't know is there is there a better thing to do let's buy an iron sword oh he that was a good play of fireballing I have uh I have obby and now they know that's so sad. But generally, when you when you see a two-layer bed defense, you kind of have an idea that uh, that it's potentially obby. Um, oh, this guy's going to drop down here? Yeah, that wasn't the play. He came right into my arms. Um, I don't want these emeralds spreading. Oh, he's going to run? I should have went and spent them somewhere then. I thought he was going to come and try to kill me. So I guess I'll just chase this guy down a bit. I don't know. Um... Okay, we will have a mad encounter. Okay, he I got a nice starting combo. He got a nice counter combo going. But yeah, I'm glad I threw out those uh, those M's. Otherwise, this pink player is potentially getting invis. I'm unsure if this pink player knows about my obsidian. I know the gray player did since um, since they fireballed it and then and then ran off afterwards. But this pink player might not have uh, an idea about my obby, which gives me a huge advantage. Let's find out where they are. Uh, looks like they ran to gray base. Yeah, they're now over here. I don't know what their level of prod is, but I think it's pretty dang good. Let's see what's up. He's going to run and have another encounter with me. I opened my tracker somehow. Or, yeah, I did. I don't know. Oh my god, that was a close fight. His level of prod was insane. Alright, good. Good fight, man. Good fight. Yeah, I think that would have been a bit of a better fight if I didn't open my compass, but who cares. Welcome to the second game, everybody. Uh, I just had an, an amazing game uh, on... This map right here, Yui, uh, we had, we had like a couple people hack using me, the last person did something really silly with a fireball, he did like a weird trick, and then ended up sending himself right off the edge, super hilarious situation. Uh, right after, I'm like, that's an awesome game, let's include that in the video, and then who would have guessed, I didn't press record, so, so that's real cool. The reason I'm stalling here at the beginning as opposed to rushing my first rush here, is because I wanted, oh, well they fell off. <laughs> I wanted them to rush first, just so I could then get above them and jump down and smack them off. That's kind of my play in singles. I wait for my, my first rush to rush me first, at least halfway so they get going. Um, got it. I was really hoping that uh, my shears would break the bed quick enough. I thought I had enough time, and I sure did. Pink and gray traded beds, so that's pretty cool. I'm down for that. Should I go explore mid? Maybe I should. Actually, I don't think I'm going to go mid. Because red's coming over to me as a final kill. S Pink and blue are doing something stupid over there. Hey, red, jump on down. You can't see me, right? I'm <laughs> I'm hiding. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, let's see if I can kill this person. That was a good block placement from them, but unfortunately for them, I had blocks behind me. So, their knockback strategy didn't really work. Hey, Pink, what are you doing over here? What the heck? 
Okay, you're dead too. Um, <laughs> okay, you tried to run, didn't work. That, is Gray gonna run over here too? Oh wait, Gray's out of the game. It's only Aqua and White and they're on the opposite side. Wait, this game's actually gonna be so quick. This makes up for the last game that I, I just played on this map. Actually, no it doesn't, because the last game was actually, like, it's hard to come by really, really silly Bed Wars players. I mean, every once in a while you'll encounter them still, but, but I feel like they're becoming less and less common. So when you, when I got something like that, it was like, it was like, mwah, chef's kiss. But either way, I think we can just go ahead and end this game, possibly. Um, Aqua and White are both chilling right there. I don't know if either of them have diamond upgrades, which, since I've been to diamond gens, it's making this a lot easier for me, I think. One thing that someone last game was doing, uh, was fireball jumping from the diamond gen to bases and back. Again, you weren't able to see that since I didn't record for some reason, but apparently it's possible. Let me go ahead and give this a try. Okay. <laughs> Maybe that was a TNT jump range instead. <laughs> okay, now I'm just looking like a fool. All I know is an explosion happened and this person... Do I even include this game? Okay, we're here on Lucky Rush. I don't know if I've... This is one of the newer maps. I don't know if I uh, recorded on this map yet. I think I have, but if I haven't, uh, this is pretty much just orchestra, but catered towards gambling, which is real nice. Um, everyone knows Hypixel and their gambling. Uh, they go hand in hand with those uh, Bed Wars loot boxes, right? <laughs> Look, I'm totally fine with the loot boxes because it keeps Bed Wars from becoming pay to win, uh, which pay to win games are always a little silly. I'd prefer to have uh, games where you need skill to win, um, but that's okay. You know, pay to win is, is an option. I do play Pokemon Go, though, on a regular basis, which is like the definition of a pay to win game. Like, it is the most pay to win game out there. I got my first rush out of the way. I don't know if I've explored mid a whole lot. This mid reminds me of Lotus. Uh, I don't know if you all remember what Lotus is. It's Because it, these kind of look like flowers. I'm pretty sure that, I mean, they're supposed to be poker chips, but they kind of just look like flowers, which reminds me of Lotus. Do I want to get more M's? I suppose I will. They just respawned and it, it, you can get all eight M's so incredibly quickly on this map. Because we're playing on pretty much orchestra, I don't think I'm gonna get obsidian. I think I'm just gonna go for the win. Like I think I'm just gonna buy diamond armor, uh, speed and jump and see if I can break some beds. Cause everyone's taking out their first rush. Uh, I think I'm gonna go for red first, seeing as I'm pretty sure they, they took out their first rush first. I also don't don't know what he's doing over on the bridge there. He's doing he well he's slow bridging for one, but also he keeps freezing and just not doing anything. Is this gonna be a free bed? Maybe. I think it is. Uh, let's see if he keeps lagging. Hopefully he does, so I can get a free kill as well. I'm actually okay with him running out onto the diamond gen here. I cannot believe that I took that much knockback. I also should have block clutched to be fair. I didn't I didn't get my head in the right spot when I did that. But I cannot believe that this guy sent me so incredibly far. <laughs> Uh, is he gonna keep pushing towards my base? I think he's just gonna grab some more diamonds. Was that a knockback stick? I can't really tell. Uh, this guy is going to continue hurrying to my base. Is he going to get there is the question. I don't have a minor fatigue trap, meaning... Yeah, he successfully got there. That's alright. I'm, I'm cool taking a fight with this guy. Okay, uh, Red ended up falling in the void, so that's cool. Makes it easier for me. That's one less, uh person I gotta kill in the end of this game here. I can quick grab a green bed. Um, they they left it open. They went to mid. And I'm down to fight this green player. I'm worried about Aqua coming and cleaning it. Uh, cleaning this fight. But I'm down to fight him. It looks like he's not down to fight. If he doesn't have fireballs, I want to chase him in. Alright, let's see what he's looking to buy here. He's gonna run out to the diamond gen. Why can't I just take a fight, dude? Yeah, okay. Although this isn't a completed bridge. Oh, okay. So, so that guy, that guy didn't know that it was not completed. Oh, so he just went for a nice little run right off the edge of that bridge into the void. That's a really nice, it's a really nice thing for me at least, maybe not for him. Um, where is this last aqua player? I am very concerned. Oh, they're right there. Uh, diamond sword. I think he just went invis, unfortunately. i probably lose this. Um, yeah. Okay, I was able to land a hit, which is really good. Let's see if we can hit him away. We can. Yep, this is good. This is good. All right. Yeah, I was worried initially because of uh, he was invis and was able to get some free crits on me. But luckily, I stalled out long enough for his... Or actually, no. I hit him, so his invis went away. And then I was able to stall for long enough to be able to gap. 
regain my health and win that fight. That was good. Okay, I'm just randomly queuing maps here, and uh, we queued Orchestra. Why do they have both Lucky Rush and Orchestra in the queue at the same time? It's like the same exact map. <laughs> but whatever. I, I enjoy both these maps. I like these quick, quick rush maps. Um, this one I think I like more because it's slow iron. Actually, I'm going to be honest, I don't even remember if Lucky Rush, the, that other map, was slow iron or not. I'm so glad that pink player fell right off the edge. I also hope he disconnects from the game because it would make it a lot easier on me. And it looks like he did not disconnect from the game, but that's okay. We get this bed, and let's go ahead and pick up a kill. I don't know where he is. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> we're good, we're good. Okay, and now using my pro Bed Wars knowledge, I've spent so many hours playing Bed Wars, so many thousands of hours playing Bed Wars, um, and... I judged off of IGNs that red and blue have sweatier IGNs, so I want to go to that side of the map. <laughs> okay, so blue is not paying attention. Thank goodness. I love free beds. Uh, but they were able to take out red, so they did something all right. Uh, they're no longer in the game. I was under the assumption that blue looked directly at me coming to their base, so I don't know what they were doing. Either they, like, one, didn't want a bed anymore, they wanted to play bedless, or two, they didn't see me. Maybe they were just completely blind. Um, they couldn't see anything, and they were using subtitles to uh, to find out what was happening in the game. I am slightly worried about this white player collecting emeralds. I think I'm going to go directly towards them. I have four emeralds. I think I want to go drop them off over here at Aqua. I don't think white team has eight, and if they do and they're about to get obsidian, then, well, frick. But either way, uh, if I lose this encounter, which I might... Especially if he fireballs me. Especially if he fireballs me. <sighs> okay, we're alive. We're alive. We're alive. Don't have another one. He has another one. He still has another one. <laughs> okay, here we go. Got a nice kill. I do have minor fatigue for five seconds, which is also the amount of time it takes for him to respawn. Go, 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 go. No, I didn't get it. I figured I wasn't going to be able to win another fight against this guy, so I just went for the bed. That really sucks. Dude, minor fatigue is so good. Has anyone ever said that before? I'm saying that sarcastically because I feel like I say that all the time. I love Minor Fatigue, and that's the only trap worth buying, really. I mean, I guess there are some very rare cases to buy uh, to buy Alarm, I think. But, dude, Minor Fatigue traps are so good. Uh, I have a set of potions now. Does this person have a set of potions? Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to drink speed because this might actually help me win this fight. You know what? Nah. If he wants to get my bed, I'll, I'll let him. I'm just going to go break his bed real quick. I think he knows, because I, I, green is also coming after this white player. So I think he knows that he's just going to lose uh, lose his bed eventually. So let's go ahead and break this bed real quick. Is he going to come over to my base? I don't know. If he does, I think that's all right. The first fight against him went really well. So, okay. I don't think I have a minor fatigue trap. Oh, but he's not going to my base. He's heading over here. I'm going to drink this invis, and here's why. I'm going to get a few free crits on him uh, because I'm invis, I'm pretty sure. Dang, he's unfortunately purling, which is real unfortunate. He must have known I was drinking invis. He may have gone in F5 or something. That's actually so sad, but very good awareness from this player here. Good, Very good awareness. Oh, my bed is completely undefended. <laughs> I didn't realize I didn't even put down a defense. I'm still going to buy minor fatigue just so I know when my bed's about to break. Um, but yeah, I don't have a defended bed right now. Since we're on orchestra, I'm just gonna buy three speed potions. It'll help me with mid fights. And it looks like white is continually fighting green and winning at that. But white refuses to ever fight me, which is really sad. White, why don't we have a nice little PvP encounter? Why do you keep running from me? Could we just fight real quick? Just real quick, have a nice little tussle? 1v1. 1v1 nice little- we're playing solo. You can't wait for your teammate or something. Where are you going? I am slowly catching up to this guy. I got a nice hit. I got another nice hit. He pearled. Please don't go to my base. He's dead. Oh my god, I didn't know he was so low. <laughs> okay, that's actually huge for me. Because uh, my bed would have been gone if that pearl landed. That was the clo <laughs> That was such a close call with that pearl. Is this guy just trying to run past? Dude- not happening. No, no, no. Don't. That's not happening on my watch. Uh-uh. Maybe this is why White kept taking fights with uh, that green player. Like, that white player wasn't bad. Uh, I mean, obviously, to have the awareness that I went invis and then pro mid. Although the few fights that we did have, they were in my favor. But, but still, that player wasn't bad. I feel like 
they would have had a decent chance if they just went straight for me. Don't kill me. All right, I died, but I'm the only one with the bed, so I'm feeling pretty good here. I, I'm just not even putting down a bed defense. Not worth it at this point, you know? I feel like at this point, if I'm losing my bed, I'm losing my bed no matter what defense I have. Maybe if I end up with Obby, then it'll be better for me, but we'll see here. Um, green is chilling over here. Dude, I still can't get over how clutch that kill on, on white team was. Like, that pearl was like probably half a second, maybe less, from landing on my base and making me lose my bed. I don't know if that would have lost me the game, but it would have at least made me lose my bed. And I got a last second hit. Oh my god, what is up with these people? Why are they all... Okay, hold on. I'm going invis just because I need to stall for this guy to lose his. Um, I'm going to quick drink my speed potion and run. Because um, I'll be moving faster than this guy since I have speed. Um, I want to grab M's real quick because I want to get a tracker on him because he has invis. So many pearls this game. That was the third one thrown. I mean, pearls are amazing. Okay, there he is. I'm going to get a tracker on him anyway just so he can't run away. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and go invis again. And I have 10 seconds of speed left. I think we'll be good. Let's see. Oh, he was actually able to land that hit. Perfect. Again, I'm just using that fireball to uh to stall a little bit so I can get a gap in. If he gaps too, that's all right. Um, But he's going to TNT jump somewhere. <laughs> Why are these games so free? Like... <laughs> Honestly, I feel like that guy as well had a chance of winning if he just fought me. Why are people just running the whole time? Just fight me. Okay, we're here on Skyrise. I always just want to call this map Rooftop. Why did Hypixel make two maps based on the tops of buildings? Who knows? I'm just glad green is not side rushing. Um, shout out to all the people who don't side rush on Skyrise. You are my friend. Kind of. You're only kind of my friend. So don't start, don't start calling me like buddy or anything. Although, to be fair, buddy is such a derogatory term, I feel like. You know? Like, no one says buddy in, like, an actual friendly manner. When you call someone buddy, it's because you're trying to insult them. You're trying to be like, I'm the bigger person. No, please don't combo me. Why? <laughs> I feel like that guy wasn't taking any knockback. Who cares? I won the fight. No, no complaints. I know you guys down there in the comment section are about to go crazy right now. You're like, he's actually just way better than you. I know, okay? That he's better than me. All right? I'm sorry. I'm sorry for even mentioning that. What was I saying? Oh yeah, buddy. Buddy. The word buddy, I hate that. Don't call me buddy, okay? If I see you, you call me buddy, I don't like you. Even if you're my buddy, in the literal term, don't call me buddy. Pal? No, don't call me pal either. Pal sucks. Friend? Friend's okay. Friend is very friendly. Um, I was gonna go this way. Blue bed's gone though, meaning I'm going straight towards a green base instead. Um, hopefully I can grab all their diamonds as well. One thing I like about this map is when you're going to someone's base, uh, you can grab their diamonds on the way there, which is real nice. So let's see if I can do that. I sure can't. All the diamonds are gone. But if there's no fireballs, which there's not, I can go ahead and grab a bed. Yay, very exciting. Very exciting for the bed break. Uh, they have iron armor and I don't, meaning they are better off. Um, okay. <laughs> better off the edge, I guess. Not <laughs> better off in this game. Okay, I'm going to start heading towards white base then. Um, I still am only in leather armor with a stone sword. They have iron armor, which is very scary. Uh, I will just have to use my PvP expertise to win this game, I guess. Also, if I end up dying over here, I'm pretty sure I can go back to iron armor. Like, iron armor will be waiting at my base for me. I'm gonna throw those off just because- Oh my god! Aw. Oh my god, stop that! Don't- You have another one. You have another one, I know you do. I think I saw it. Although, if you throw another one and I deflect it back at your bed, Oh, you're mad that I'm... You have sharp... Where are these people? I feel like I took out my first rush real quick. Where are these people getting gear from? You do have another one. You do have another one. Stupid. Now you now you actually learned to throw it at the bridge, not me. Ouch, I was hit again by an iron sword. Don't... Oh my god. That is the most upsetting thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I... I was going crazy. I was deflecting fireballs. And if I just didn't jump off on my own... That was my bed. That was that was a free bed. Although, to be fair, I was anticipating that person to hit me, which, that's why I ran in that direction. It would have counteracted their hit a little bit. Okay, I'll just come up here. One block, that's not enough. One block, not enough. Oh my god. We were able to land 
the hits to get the kill. That's huge. I don't have very much health. I don't feel very confident in this PvP fight, if I'm being honest. Dude, you have minor fatigue. You don't have minor fatigue anymore. That's good. That's very good. Um, you're gonna place ladders. Honestly, I'm okay with ladders. Actually, I take that back. I hate ladders. Get out of here. How low is this person? Oh, in gap range, in gap range. Um, coming back up. Give me that bed. Oh my god, just in time. Oh wait, why did I switch my axe? That happened with the compass fight earlier. Where every once in a while, since I bu I've been butterfly clicking recently as opposed to jittering, which is what I used to do in the past. Um, I end up fat fingering the scroll wheel, which sends me back one. So every once in a while, you'll see me switch to my axe and fight. Uh, and that's also how I switched to my compass in that other previous fight. Uh, I'm going to quick go by sharp because it's going to make these fights way more in my favor. Uh, with sharp, but uh, yeah, I have fat fingers. So, um, so shout out to all the fat finger folks in my in my viewer base. And land the fireball. Didn't I? Didn't land the fireball, but I did try. Nah, he says nah. Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna keep chasing this gray person. Um, to see if I can pick up the kill. I am. Oh. Okay, again, that's another player that I feel like had a chance of winning the fight against me if they actually fought. What is going on with everyone just jumping off the edge on their own? Is that what happens in Solo Bed Wars? I haven't played in a while. Solo Bed Wars is the new meta to just jump off the edge and die on your own because um, I feel like it is. Uh, although this white player, who's actually pretty good, uh, is collecting a lot of M's, and that is very scary. Hello. Fight time. 1v1. I mean, to be fair, that person at least tried to fight before jumping off the edge, but it still ended with the same way as everyone else, just flying right off the, the edge of the map into the void. All right, sure. Well, everybody, that's been another episode of Bed Wars. It's been great having you here watching my Bed Wars video. Do all the normal stuff. Subscribe and like. Check out my Lunar Cloaks and buy them if you don't want money. Uh, use code GamerBoydy in the Hypixel shop if you end up spending money in the Hypixel shop. And check out my YouTube channel, and check out my Twitch channel, and check out my Facebook channel, check out my sweet cheeks, and we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.